Hello and welcome to another reading from the book A Wahai Calling, a Daily Devotional. Today's reading is entitled Do I Rightly Represent My Lord? October 21st Ye are my witnesses, saith the Lord, and my servant whom I have chosen. Isaiah 43.10 if believers associate with unbelievers for the purpose of winning them to Christ, they will be witnesses for Christ, and having fulfilled their mission, will withdraw themselves in order to breathe in a pure and holy atmosphere. They will draw near to God and send up earnest petitions to Christ in behalf of their friends and associates, knowing that He is able to save unto the uttermost all that come unto God by Him. When in the society of unbelievers, ever remember that in character you are a representative of Jesus Christ, and let no light and trifling words, no cheap conversation be upon your lips. Keep in mind the value of the soul, and remember that it is your privilege and your duty to be in every possible way a laborer together with God. You are not to lower yourself to the same level as that of unbelievers, and laugh and make the same cheap speeches. In thus doing, you make yourself one with the sinner. This manner of conduct will only make you a stumbling block in the way of sinners. When the Holy Spirit moves upon the heart, we should cooperate with its molding influence, and we shall have noble aspirations, a clear perception of truth, meekness, teachableness, and will perform our duty with humility. This is the way in which you will become better acquainted with God, and acquaintance with God is the privilege of the Christian. Then you can labor for those who are unconverted, and the society of unbelievers will do you no harm, because your life is hid with Christ in God, and you seek the companionship of those who are out of Christ for the purpose of winning them to His service. Your connection with God makes you strong spiritually so that you can withstand any wrong influences which are exerted by them. Be sure to place yourself in the channel of light and to be a practical follower of Him who went about doing good. Thank you for listening today. Be sure to join me tomorrow for another reading from the book, Our High Calling. God bless you.